Pesto. Chile and sea bass sounds a lot better. So we went ahead, we started our wash, and our wash is basically milk, a little bit of egg, a little yeah. bit of baking soda, and then we dipped it in flour, uh, cayenne, and blackened seasoning. I wonder why the flour was darker. So the cayenne and it's the black seasoning. Cayenne and blackened seasoning just gave it a little red. And then we went ahead, we heated up some olive oil in a pan, and we're just going to go ahead and sear both sides of this. Okay, and you've got some asparagus here going as well, too. Some asparagus going on the side, yes. All right, now. Uh, the other thing that blew me away when I walked in here is that enormous single serving of chocolate cake. And Elise, this is really a serving available at New York Prime. Yeah, these are desserts at New York Prime. So, of course, obviously, that is the chocolate cake. This is the white chocolate banana cream pie, which is personally my favorite, the pecan sandy crust. And then we have our Carnegie Deli cheesecake topped with some strawberries there. Okay, I got to do this really quickly. <laughs> This is do my it. fist. Let me see if you can get this again. There's my <laughs> fist, right? This is like one fifth of my fist of the entire serving. That's one serving. You could serve about six people with that, possibly? About six people, yeah. All right. Yeah. And you were saying this too, Elise. You said uh, if, if guys want to impress their wives or girlfriends, or vice versa, the women to the men, they can pick up these desserts yet, right? They sure can at New York Prime, yeah. You can get them to go. And also, if you're not like a great cook, if you want to yeah. get your stuff to go at New York Prime, we'll do it for you. You could lay it out like this. Nobody yeah. would ever know. Well, then maybe they might know, but they it's might okay. Know too. It's it's all right. You and, make the effort. And that goes for all the restaurants, too, right? Absolutely. You can get it to go and sneak it yep. on the table, add the candles, and you're almost as golden as this. <laughs> How long would you typically well, let this go? We're, we're going about a minute on each side, just until we get this brown color. Um, and then once we take it off, we're going to go ahead and place it into a pie pan. Yeah. Oh, that smells delicious, And once too. it's in a pie pan, our, you know, our pan's hot with oil and some of the fish juices all mm -hmm. kind of came out. So we're going to go ahead and take some white wine. Yep. Wow. And this is going to deglaze the pan. It's basically going to clean the pan. Whoa. And, uh, and watch out for flames. It's basically kind of clean the pan. <laughs> now, be honest, was that supposed to happen? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> that was extra for you. A little bit of bonus, okay. Now, we're going to go ahead and take our deglazed plan, uh, pan and go ahead and pour it over our sea bass. Now, this is going to go into the oven, and yeah. it's going to cook for about 12 minutes, about 450 degrees. Okay, so you just really 